everybody, and welcome to episode 12 of the Disguise PC at Remote LP. I'm Buddy Bison, and let's get into the next map. So, Jotunheim or Jotunheim. Okay. Miss Edna, may I ask you a question? What? Well, you look pretty serious. That's not like you at all. Mr. Vyers mentioned that you killed the Overlord's son. Is that true? Oh, that. Yeah, I killed him. Why do you care? So it wasn't a lie. Why would he lie? Why? Why did you have to kill him? What's it to you? To tell you the truth, I was sent from Celestia to assassinate the Overlord. But I can't kill people without a good reason, even if the Seraph commands it. That's why I need to know. Why did you kill him? Are you dense? Why are you telling me your secret mission? Miss Edna, please answer my question. He may have been the Overlord's son, but he was such a selfish little brat. So, I shot him with my gun. I guess they're pretty lethal. I'm glad he's dead. You killed him because you didn't like him? Yep. But what if he liked you? <laughs> yeah, right. That would never happen, even if heaven and hell collided. That kid hated love and friendship more than anything. How sad. Angels are so weird. There's no point in feeling bad for someone who's already dead. No, I'm sad for you, Miss Etna. What? Why? You don't have to pretend. I know you didn't mean to kill him, and now you're starting to regret it. Yeah, right. I feel great. Why are you denying the truth? Even if you feel no remorse, you should openly express your feelings. However I feel, the prince is still dead. So stop bringing him up. I don't want to think about that brat. The Overlord must be sad, too. Who knows? There's no going back, no matter what we do. I see. He sent the perfect candidate. She should be able to bridge the gap between Celestia and the Netherworld. Okay. Uh, so we got... Kill that symbol. Not expect that type of thing. Because um, you're not supposed to be able to uh, throw diagonally. So they never really accounted for it. Okay. I need to get. Use Flan to. Okay, good. 
both. Those are out of play. the map expands out a little bit more. Find out one more thing. Uh, 
still gonna be trying to get team attacks on the Hogweiser and the Christina and Faya. Unless that guy kills Christina right now. Um, you're fine with this. Oh, I think these guys is like special thing. Was that like you can only hit them from the back or something? guys' ranges are. to do that one because I believe they can't counter uh, skills that change your movement or that change your place. Okay. Do that. 
Wipe my team. Okay. Uh, ha ha ha. Uh, hospital. Okay. How's my money situation looking in terms of buying a good lens? I could. some money and buy some good weapons to go into the next mode with. I'm not sure yet if I'll do that, uh, but it would make the beginning of the next game, or I don't want to say next game, but the next run easier, because I already have like 13 hours into the game. I think I still have one more after this. Imagine because usually the final battle ends with. Oh my god, so many. Okay, so level 30, that's not too bad. Okay, so there's only one level 30, there's no. This one's just a bunch of people. It's not especially. Uh, difficult. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to. This doesn't seem like a bad map. It seems rather uh, simple, in all honesty. But I don't want uh, my main damage dealing characters to be uh, dying to these guys. Uh, if, they, if they die to that mean guy, like that big one in the back, just to take that. Not to those tiny ones. And if I can prevent them from getting stas effects as well. That's Okay, so you 
can't, can't shoot lower than myself. That is dumb. the unfortunate part about Axe uh, people is they generally don't have a lot of... Oh, those guys are all immune to ice, essentially. I'll uh, just take out these guys. They're, it's like one and done. Like you, get, you get one guy. You get to hit one person. Uh, that's it. They generally, at least in the earlier don't have any AoE attacks, which is... Okay. Now things are spreading out a bit. How are you guys with ice? You guys are just really good against it. Okay, so wind is zero.
might as well try and get all, as much damage as possible. Okay. <sighs> You're annoying. Just in case. Okay. Yes, go for the cat. Uh, just in case I need range. So it might be. It might behoove me to, uh. to prepare for that type of thing. That's probably gonna kill him. Master Lamington! Master Lamington, are you here? Calm down, Volcanus. You're beginning to scare the spirits. Who cares about the spirits? I have received a report on Flan's activities in the Netherworld. Flan has failed to assassinate the Overlord and she's become friendly with the demons. Assassinating an overlord is a much too difficult assignment for an angel trainee. Let me carry out this mission. Volcanus, tell me, when were you appointed god? W w what are you talking about? Uh, I am here to serve my purpose as an archangel. Did you think I wouldn't know? Uh, I cannot accept this state of affairs. Everything is proceeding as scheduled. I have every faith in Flan to fulfill her duties. Her idealism shall hold firm. Okay, Grand... Okay, now we're... Grand North Ice Beast. Okay, so I think we're entering the final uh, section of uh, the thing. So I'm going to end the episode here because we are running a bit long. We're at like 31 minutes-ish. So, well, actually, it's going to be less uh, because of the cuts I have to make. Uh, so, with that, I hope you all have a very nice day, and I'll see you possibly in the last episode, I'm sure, of the Enemodo Pay. Bye! <laughs>